Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Priscilla, and I am here today with another monthly box from Sketchbox! If you have never heard of this really cool box, it is called Sketchbox, which is an art subscription box. So every month, this ultimate box of wonderful artness gets sent straight to your door. And this is the premium box. It's got cool looking art all over the box and everything. And so let's go ahead and open it up and see what's inside. So this is what we see when we look inside. Oh, this is the May box. And as you can see, they go ahead and tell me uh, this is the May box. So what's really cool is Sketchbox sends me this cute little postcard print. So this is a chance for me to check out this artist online, learn all about this artist, and it's all on the back. So you just broaden your horizons on artists and different art styles. And then Sketchbox is amazing that they sent me these detailed, wonderful description of all the art that is sent in this box and tells me how much every single art supply is. So that's really nice because if I want to go back and I want to buy a certain art supplies or get more of this art supplies, then I can look at the price and be like, hmm, okay. So I can price it out online and everything. So that's really an amazing attribute to Sketchbox. I am extremely excited because I have not worked with watercolor pencils in so long. You can see the reflection. Camera, lights, action, look at inception. That is the twilight sound. So here are the 12 amazing colors that are in this particular package. Very, 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 very nice quality. Very cool. And then I am given a Zig CNKC 2200 double ended marker. Mm. Is pink. And then one side is pink. <laughs> so I have a pink marker. One's a brush tip end and then one's a fine tip end. My favorite. I am given a Micron 08 tip pen. These are my favorite lining pens. Always excited to use anything by Micron. Then I am given a Karen D. Ake. Karen D. Ake. <laughs> Fiber tipped water brush. This looks fancy. Look, it's even got little push, push end. And you could push for more water. It's nice and oh, that's different. Look at this. This is totally not like a water, a water brush pen. It's it's different. It's not a watercolor brush. It's an it's like a felt like Copic markers. And these are super adorable. They're little watercolor pads. Oh, yuppo, yuppo, mini pads. <gasps> Oh, I want to read this. I'll read this to you guys. What sets Sketchbox apart is the ability to compare an entire range of, brand, of a brand's offering. Not just one item. This month we included the full range up from Legion's unique multimedia paper. Painting or drawing with the ultra smooth surface of a yuppo is different than regular watercolor or drawing paper and will require some adjustments by the artist. Yuppo is a synthetic polypropylene substrate with a non-porous surface that repeals water so you can, you can you can create, recreate, wipe clean, and start again if you'd like. It's truly unique. Take out on a watercolor paper and perfect for this month. The most favorite thing from this package, this is a Sketchbox signature box. I've got an octopus. Check that out, that's so cool. I know exactly where it's gonna go. It's gonna go on my laptop with the endless amount of stickers all over my laptop. I'm not just going to show off these beautiful supplies. Let's go ahead and jump into a time lapse and I'm gonna show you how I would approach using all these different supplies that Sketchbox has sent to me in this month's signature box. So let's go ahead and get started. So this is what it would look like if you were just to go and open up the box. So you got all these amazing art supplies just waiting for you. And I already put the octopus sticker on the front of my laptop. So I grabbed each Yuppo pad and I took a piece of paper out. Um, yes, they are different. So I just wanted to go ahead and draw like a little mini doodle on each little piece of Yuppo pad with the watercolor pencils just to see. Um, they're non-porous, so that means that they cannot suck up watercolor as well. And even when I was working with 
the the zig uh, brush pen the double-ended brush pen I was seeing that when I kept drawing the little mermaid on her hair and her tail I was realizing yes it's extremely like almost like an expo board so it's like a whiteboard and it's like working with expo markers so it's really interesting to work with but what I wanted to do was I went ahead and I grabbed one of my own pieces of watercolor paper just to show you guys with how how the watercolor Derwent watercolor pencils would work on regular watercolor paper since the Yuppo mini pads were um they had a cool effect with the watercolor but they just weren't showing that awesome technique, that awesome feel that watercolor leaves behind on proper paper, whether you're using mixed media or you're using different watercolor, uh, Canson watercolor paper. I just wanted to go ahead and just demonstrate the Derwent watercolor pencils on one of my pieces of Strathmore paper, um, just to show you guys how that would look. So when I was thinking about what should I draw for this sketchbox video, I wanted to go ahead and keep going with the, since it's still May, there is a hashtag going on on Instagram right now called Mermay. So I went ahead and I drew a mermaid. Um, this is no particular mermaid that you guys would know. I just kind of made her up. Been a really long time since I've used uh, watercolor pencils, so I had to reteach myself how to use them. I probably didn't use them correctly, but <laughs> I really love the way I shaded her skin in this video. And I think the problem that I was having with watercolor pencils is I forgot how to layer with them, and I wasn't. I think that was my only struggle. And I probably should have watched some amazing artist um, YouTube tutorial before I jumped into these watercolor pencils. But the Derwent watercolor pencils are very, very nice to work with. They've got beautiful, vibrant colors. If this video doesn't show how vibrant they are or demonstrate how vibrant they are, they're very vibrant in person. So I would suggest if you are interested in getting watercolor pencils, Derwent is a great brand. So what I used to line her skin was the Micron pen. I love the brand Microns. Um, there's a couple of other brands that I use, but the Micron pens are always what I go back to when it comes to lining my drawings. And I use the sepia toned ones and black ones. Honestly, if I think I was, I think that when I was making this mermaid, I was just thinking of all the things that I would want for me to look like as a mermaid. So. <laughs> I know I would want blue hair. I would want a purple galaxy looking tail. I didn't put galaxy on her, but I just would want that color scheme of purple, pinks, and blues. And I definitely, I just want blue hair. I wish I could have blue hair. If I could get an awesome blue wig, then I would feel like I would be, I would be the mermaid all the time. But, um, but yeah, I just thought it was really fun working with this and as you can see I'm struggling and trying to figure out how to layer and I don't know if it's particularly the paper that's preventing me to layer well or I just don't know how to watercolor pencil well. Other than that this was a lot of fun and it's great to work with watercolor pencils again maybe now that I have this amazing set from Derwent and Sketchbox then I can go ahead and start practicing with them again. So there you go, there is May's sketch box opening. This once again is the premium box. Now you can go ahead and jump on to their website, which is getsketchbox.com, and it's gonna be put right here. And I'll put the link down below in the info box. Go and click on it and check out all the amazing opportunities Sketchbox offers and get your own premium box every month. It's really cool and it's a different way to um, stretch yourself as an artist when it comes to working with different art supplies. You never know. One of these beautiful supplies could be calling out to you because watercolor, people absolutely want to stay away from watercolor and then chances are they absolutely love it and watercolor turns 
turns out to be their most favorite thing in the world. You just, you don't have to be intimidated by art supplies. Just try them out, give them a go. Chances are you're gonna fall in love with them. But Sketchbox is an amazing opportunity. Thank you once again, Sketchbox, for sending me this amazing box. I hope you all will go check it out and I hope you all will have a most wonderful day. Do, 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 do.